Hello friends, this is your buddy Nick here with Game with the Guys, and I decided to play a little Dark Souls 2. So let's get to it. Now I just wanted to point out that this is version 1.06, and let's see, calibrations 1.08. This is between the first and second DLCs coming out, so if you're seeing things that are a little wonky for one reason or another, maybe I'm on a different calibration than you. Anyway, let's go through here. Things betwixt, punch that skeleton, head on through. Now, I like to play as magic builds, sorcerer builds, mages, wizards, whatever you want to call it. Um, and I also like having great big swords. So this is my playthrough of a mage with a great big sword. Now let's head on and Talk to these fine ladies here. Except for I'm not going to talk to them. I'm going to skip all the screens like that because you've seen them. I passed up my letter. You've seen all those screens. You don't need to see them again. If you really want to see them, I'll start putting them in. Just let me know and I can do it. Otherwise, I'm just going to assume that you don't really care. Because you've seen it a million trillion times. Now... I'm naming my character Tadpole. It's a name I've used many times before. I don't know. I, I don't know how long I've been using it. Ever since I was a little kid, I guess. Um, maybe it's like super deep stuff because you start out so weak and you become big and strong like a frog eventually. Um, and as you see, I am playing as a female character here. Uh, I think they, I, I, I don't think they get enough love. So I'm going to play as a female character. And just a little bit of customization real quick. I like to do um, I like to do characters with white hair because I think it looks awesome. And let me go ahead and just give her some red eyes to make her look a little extra a little extra badass. And even though I do like to play as magic builds, this time I'm gonna start out as a cleric. And I just think that they get some awesome stuff to start out with. So why not? Why not have good stuff to start out with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've all heard it. Dragon Talon. As you can see, this is... Whoop. Got to go and grab that bonfire ascetic up here. And by bonfire ascetic, I didn't mean human effigy. Because, of course I did. There it is. It's a human effigy of you. And down the stairs. Out the dough. Don't forget to light your bonfires. That's some magical stuff right there. All right. Now I'm going to go ahead and just, you know, mostly just skip things betwixt. Uh, there's not really anything in here that I want that much. I might come back later and, you know, just to get the Handmaiden's Ladle, the most powerful weapon in the game. But no, just going to skip it. And as I come through this cavern up here, you'll notice usually a bunch of messages appear on the ground that say, Praise the sun! And all sorts of stuff like that. But I decided to play in offline mode because I don't want all that clutter. I don't want the, uh, the trolls saying, Oh, there's an imaginary wall over here. Illusionary wall. So I decided to just turn off. But I am going to come down here. And I don't particularly need this stuff. But I like to pick up a lot of extra stuff, you know, just to sell it off later. Extra souls and all. Binoculars, though. That's why I really went down there. That is what I like to call the Mage's Sniper Scope. And you will see me using that a lot. It is helpful. Oh, I do not want to forget to light this bonfire. I oftentimes do. And that's next one I do. So I'm not going to do it this time. I'm just going to pick up a few things here in the beautiful coastal town of Majula. Coming into this first shop. I don't remember this guy's name, but let's be honest. Uh, he's a forgettable fellow. He's kind of a jerk. So what do I do? I just come up here and I rob him. Now, I'm not condoning robbing people, even if they are jerks. But, you know, what's he doing with the tight night shard? Nothing. That's what. But I do like his shop because it's built in to the side of the mountain or the cliff edge there. So that's pretty cool. And I don't know what rich and powerful person has this excellent mansion 
built in the beautiful coastal town of Majula. But they're not using it. So. Let me come over here. Run by my boy Lemongrass shop. Pretty busted up shop. So, I feel like he could easily climb through this window and get in. And many people have pointed that out before. But what I want to know is, who locked him out? What? Why does Malentia have the key? What is going on in Majula? Anyway, let me talk to the Emerald Herald here. The next monarch. I sure hope so. I cannot get a good angle here. I. Oh, jeez. Can you please stop talking? Thank you. Thank you for that. But oh my God, that's enough. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Emerald Herald, please stop talking. Seek those. Okay. Yeah. I. Yes. I understand that. Okay. Is that a shard you found? Yes, it is a shard. To see light. Okay. Fine. Just up. Upgrade my SS flask. And. Ten minutes later, my my flask is upgraded. Awesome. All right. Now, they I think they intend for you to go to the Forest of the Fallen Giants to start off the game, but I don't particularly like to do that. I like to come over here, grab a life gem. Oh, oh, stuck on an invisible tent. And then I like to run up here and join the Champion's Covenant. Okay, I'm totally kidding. I'm not going to join the co that covenant. I'm just going to grab these homeward bones. I'm just going to grab the bones. They're going to become very handy for me later. When I have to warp a billion trillion times when I'm farming. You'll see. Anyway, uh, before I mentioned I like to use the cleric to start out with. I like their beginning stuff. Uh, they start off with some really good armor to begin with. And... Also, the mace, I'm a big fan of. Now, what's odd, though, is they start you off with less strength than what is required to wield it. So I have to double fist this bad boy. Which, uh, everybody likes a little double fisting now and again. Crimson Parma. The first shield for me. All right. Let's pull this unnecessary lever for that unnecessary gate. Put on some stuff here. Get my little sniper scope out. Let's put on my old Estus flask. Get my life gems rocking. All right. And let's move on through. Good stuff there, I guess. All right. On to Hate's Tower of Flame. Now, early on in the game, I do like to pretty much run through these levels pretty quickly. I skip a lot of stuff. Um, a lot of it I will come back and get later on, but mostly I'm just trying to run and get my favorite weapon in the game real quick. So you'll see me, whoa, running by some stuff real quick, like these guys, for example. No need to fight them. Not at this moment, anyway. Wow! Oh, I got smacked. I got smacked. I was trying not to get smacked, but I got smacked. Oh, great. My puppy dog hears some other dogs barking, and now he's freaking out. Anyway. Thank you for uh, getting the hell out of my way. I really appreciate that. So I'm going to run down here toward the first boss that I'll be facing, the uh, Dragon Rider fella. But first, let me grab some green blossoms. Because these are pretty awesome. Awesome blossom. Alright. Move it, move it, move it. I've got business to attend to. And you can get this guy to suicide if you're lucky. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Let's see if he'll happily jump off the little edge there for me. And away he goes. Alright. Victory achieved. Dragon Rider Soul, and shower me in riches! 12,000 souls. Really good way to start the game. <laughs> Let's run up here and talk to our good friend. There 
if you'll notice, she's praying in the direction of the sun. Are you from these parts? I am not. My name is Liz. All right, Liz, yeah, that's enough. Okay. Actually, there's nothing of yours that I want to buy. Let's go ahead and just get all your dialogue going so that I can... Uh... My precept and such is my only wish. Right, right, right. Sometimes I... And being... Okay, yeah. I expected this without any goings off to a place. Sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jerk. No, not from you. Not from you. You evil, evil. Heading back to Medjula. All right. The Emerald Herald is just sitting here, waiting, bored as hell. Get on up. Bearer of the curse. Yeah, 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 okay. I actually made a mistake. I did not want to talk to you right now, because first I wanted to go ahead and just eat the Dragon Riders. Pop! Now one thing I do like to point out, one thing that I really like about Dark Souls 2 is that they, uh, they zoom in on you when you got your... Your item's open. I think that's kind of cool looking, so you can see yourself when, you, when you're swapping stuff about. But anyway, back to leveling up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God, shut up. So from here, let me go ahead and grab some strength. 15. Let's see, I added five, six there. Uh, let's put that other one on strength. All right. Excellent. Now I can actually use my mace. Good stuff. All right. And from here, now on to the forest of the fallen giants. So let's scurry on through these hallways. Turn around here. I believe this is a rusty coin. Oh my God. How long does it take to open a chest? I'm on the clock here, come on. Open this bad boy up here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Anytime now, door. Anytime. It's like they got a little hamster on a wheel trying to open this thing. Gears going. Ugh, finally. All right. Let's head on down. This is a very dangerous jump. Do not take this lightly. <gasps> I made it. Homeward bone. I need those homeward bones. You'll find out later why. All right. And now, into the forest of the fallen. Alright, fellas, who wants to brawl? Do you want to brawl? Let's go. Let's do this. You got a friend? Swing a little sword at me? Guess what? Mace to the head. Let's see. What do we have here? Life gem. Excellent. That's come in handy. Said it before and I'll say it again. Do not forget to light your bonfires! Oh, man! Sucks when you forget one. Oh, that guy was just, just waiting, and then he saw me, and he was like, I'm gonna attack that dude, or lady, as the case might be. Swing your little knife at me. All right, excellent. Why'd you, he let me a present, he let me a life gem. It's very considerate. Oh, swapping blows there. I'm not going to wait around for you to shoot me with an arrow. I'm going to come up there and smack you in the head. Let's see. I think there's just some souls here. Yep. Run back upstream. With some more hollows. Oh. Oh, smack it a smack. All right, first things first, let's go and get some. Oh no, I fell to my death. 
To my death I fell! That jump is pretty annoying. <laughs> Attempt 57. Oh, oh! Choppity choppity chop! These guys are smacking me around a bit. Right, let's line this up a little bit better. There we go. There we go. Jumping right on across there. Throwing knives. I did all that for throwing knives. Let's be honest, the throwing knives, <laughs> the throwing knives, they're gonna come in handy. They're actually kind of awesome in the beginning of the game. All healed up, I'm ready to rock. Climbing up this ladder one more time, hopefully for the last time. Gonna go for that jump again? No, not this time. No jump this time. Just wait for me. Oh! Trade and blows. Trade and blows. Let's get this little sniper fella. Oh! Blocked ya. Blocked ya. Gotcha. Right. This jump is much easier. See that? See that? I made that one. Now, I came over there, I wanted to grab the short sword. I'm not going to use it. I just think it's a pretty awesome weapon. It's got a really cool moveset. Yeah, let me just run up here. I think there's some, some goods up here, too. All right. Souls. I need them. I need those souls. Okay. On with our quest. Quest for the Holy Grail. Alright. Here's that Hayden Knight. I'm not gonna fight him. I don't want a sword. He's too he's too tough. I'm a weakling. Could I beat him? To be honest, I suck at this game. Alright. Oh, you're just standing there waiting for me. Now you're dead. Through the fog wall. See, I like to kill this guy for some creep. Trying to jump attack me. Oh, what the? How did I not hit that guy? That's some nonsense right there. <laughs> Man. Oh, another throw. It's an embarrassment of riches. Kill this dude. Wow, that was such a terrible arrow shot. Oh, I was trying to... Oh, I'm getting smacked by fire. A hell of a throw, my man. Target went on. Oh. <laughs> Point blank, right in the face. Right in the face. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. All right. Let's come over here because I need this buckler. Oh my god, why am I just, just getting smacked around by these bills? Climb it up here. Kill this guy first. I don't want him sneaking up behind me. You need to die. Witching urns. I will make full usage of those later. Let's uh, climb in here and 
Hang out at the bottom. Fuck. For just a little. There it is. I've been looking for you. Been looking for you, bonfire. All right. That was my girl, Malentia. Let's go have a chat with her. And by chat, I mean like, buy some stuff. But, but I do want to exhaust her dialogue so that she will head back to Majula when the time comes. Yeah, it is high time you pick. So, what am I gonna buy from her? I am going to buy two, exactly, fire bombs, and one, exactly, of Lengreski. Thank you kindly. Oh, you're welcome. Let's head on up here and grab some goodies up top. Does anybody ever just wait to get the soldier key to actually go through here? That will let you in there if you don't like the brute force, the brute force method. But I don't have patience for that. Melancia trying to sell me a hand axe, and there's a free one right up here. She is a sneak. Here's the good stuff, though. Gotta get that. Estes Flask Shard. Can you open that already? Jeez, come on. And the little itty bitty soap soap. Divine Blessing. All right, let's see. Where to? Where to? Now, if you're really good, you can actually uh, throw a firebomb from right here and make it through that wall. Get the, the barrels on the other side to blow up but I don't want to waste them, so I'm just going to take the long way. I'm going to take the long way, fight a couple of these hollowed out soldiers on my way. Whoop! And third swing. Oh, you're so predictable. Oh. <laughs> there it is. Oh! <laughs> All right. Sorry about I just found that hilarious up here. All right, this guy can't get up and kill me if I've killed him first. Through this little way here. This guy's all on all fours, having a rough day, I bet. Now I need to come and talk to Kale. Bust this guy in the head. Ow. I was not even targeted on you, but still got gotcha. you. I need to equip my throwing knives. Because they come in real handy here. Like this guy. He doesn't want to come out and fight me. He wants to shoot me with his bow. So I'll just take him out like that. Oh, you guys are a little bit stronger, huh? All right. There's some archers and stuff up here, so I want to take those guys out with this, uh, my ranged attack. Oh, I'm getting beat up. Oh, shot again. This calls for an Estus Flask. Oh, dang it. <laughs> I thought that I was on my throwing knives. Oh, I got shot. All right. That's enough. That's enough, I said. Oh. Careful with that jump, or lest you fall to your death. I'm just gonna go ahead. heal up real quick, and then run straight for that thing. No, no, I'll let the I'll let that boulder go by. Now let me come up here and talk to Kale real quick. He's in such an odd position, like. 
they did not intend for the uh, <laughs> they did not intend for their little model to why can't, well uh, look over his shoulder the way he is or whatever. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but I yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, come on, Kale. Just give me that key. Give me that, Kale. I came for a key. I now yeah. Right then. Here it is. Tell me that you want to see me in Majula. Talk about Majula. There you go. See you later, Kale. Thank you for the key. Amber herb. Those come in handy. It's never. Ah. Alright, let's get out of this little joint. Well, oh, actually, first, there's a couple little items up. So let's do that. Laugh at this guy's dead body. You shot me with too many arrows. I feel no pity for you, sir. Alright. Run back. There's a Titanite shard down here that I really want to get. Okay, now that I've talked to Kale, let's come up through here and open up my way to the old bonfire. It's best to just kind of chop these guys up before they get a chance to hit... Oh, I said before they get a chance to hit you! It's like I know I'm here. I need to throw at me while I'm, while I'm defenseless. There he goes. Now you can kind of get him to do that, but I don't trust him. He's a terrible shot, so I just do it on. All right, healing up. Let's swap out these fire bombs because I want to shoot him down with throwing knife. I don't like you. Whoa! I don't want you throwing fire bombs at me. There it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enough, enough. They're all just jealous because I'm in human form and they're all hollowed and stuff. Okay. You know what? Let me try something a little different here. This might not be a good time to do it while I'm recording, but... Beep you! All right. I'm going to go over here first. Oops. <laughs> no! No! I wish I would just know how far my, <laughs> my swing would go. Ugh. I'm used to a much longer weapon, as you'll see later in this playthrough. Alright. Up the ladder. And you can go over in there and get some stuff. I don't want any of that. So I'm coming over here. Because there is stuff in here that I want. Let me put on these witching urns that I promised that I would use. Because I will use those. Use them very soon. Oh, I just walked into that. That was dumb. Alright. There's some stuff down here that I want. After I blow these guys up real quick. I can take on one. Alright, I'm gonna go grab that stuff in there after I run and kill these dudes. Hey, you. Come and fight me. 
Bring your friends. Oh. Messed that up. Come here, knife dude. Can I love me a present? Oh! It's another throwing knife. <laughs> Delayed reaction on that third swing. I just want to make sure that this gate falls down. There it goes. Now I can go and get my, my prizes. My prizes. First of all, this stuff. Aromatic ooze. Very handy. Very handy indeed. And I need to get my sorcerer's staff. Because like I said, I'm going to be using magic. So, sorcerer's staff must have. Must have. Well, for early on. I won't use it for too, too long. All right. Now let's go talk to Pate. Our good friend. First, I'm going to heal myself. I should have. Should have went over there and healed Pate too. These guys are out and about. I want my name. I just be careful. Oh, thank you. With luck. Good. Good. All right, that's enough for me. All right, now that these guys are all lost and have no clue where they're going. I hear him. I hear him. There he is. Now I think it's safe to go in there after I kill this one last... Do you even know where you're going? Man, these hollows have really lost it. All right. Wooden shield, some souls. There it is. Great soul arrow. That's what I want. I don't have a Pharos Lockstone quite yet, but I'll come down here and get the other stuff. Now this one is trapped. Oh, poison trap. Good stuff, good stuff. And there was the Pharaoh's Lock con contraption. I'll just knock on this door. These guys will come and say hello to me. Eventually. There they are. There they are, there they are. I'm glad it takes you forever to swing. Let's see, there's a couple more of these guys in here. Alright, come on. Enough of this. Ow. Oh. There we go. And what do you have for me in here? I think there's some good stuff. I think there's a chunk in here. Those chunks, man. Oh, life ring. Wah, wah. Boo. Might as well put it on, though. Let's see how much it gives me. Ooh, 46. 46 health. And nothing left to do down here until I get a lockstep. And I'll get one pretty quick. All right. Oh! <laughs> Reload areas and the bad guys end up plopping down some good stuff. All right. Let me get the attention. Whoa! That is not how I expected that to go. Heal myself real quick and take care of this, this turtle knight here. All right. I'll just, I won't even wait for you. There we go. Oh, man, that was pretty awesome. Some Homer Bones. Grab the attention of the one guy. I want to fight these guys one at a time. Okay, can you... Yeah, hurry it up, hurry it up. through the mist here. I want to grab this. There we are. 
I think I forgot about you, good sir. It's the uh, large leather shield right here. It's actually a pretty decent shield. You know, considering it's still pretty terrible. But, you know, it's a vast improvement, so let's go with that for now. And after this, I just want to go ahead and open this little shortcut here. Grab some fire arrows. Let me just run up, and I am going to make a quick trip back to Majula before I fight the last giant. So, off to Majula we go. Okay. Let's go ahead and open up Lenegrass shop for him. Steal his bow. He doesn't need it. He's a Majula. There's nothing there's nothing bad here except for some little piggies. Now I do want to go ahead and just rest the bonfire again really quickly. To make sure that he spawns back in his shop. And I'll go talk to him in just a second. I do want to go to the mansion. Because there are some good, good stuff inside. All right. Let me grab this Pharos Lockstone from here. Let's see. There's some Titanite shards up on the roof that is somewhat missing. Some Titanite shards. All right, which way? Oh. And while I'm down here, let's go fight the skeleton that we were warned about. The mace. Good for skeletons. Anyone that's played D&D &D knows that. Get that S's Flash shard. Yeah, look at this pretty box. Look at this pretty box. Grab the soul vessel from there. There's the remains of the Lord vessel. So is theorized. Now, I can go and do some upgrades. And I'll call it a day. Let me run out here, and now that I've put Lenegrass safely back into his shop, upgrade my mace. Lenegrass! Oh, Lenegrass! You. The name. Dangerous work, huh? All right. A man ought to. Not Robocop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought he said Robocop for some reason. Upgrade this. Oh, perfect. I can get this up to level three. Ah, that's enough. I don't need it. I do want to upgrade my step. All right. I'll be around when I make it back. Let's see if I've got enough for a level. Is that a shard? Here, to see luck. However. I think I've got two. Let's go ahead and upgrade this twice. No, I meant to say yes. Alright. Well, oh. About that level. Yeah, yeah, okay. The king, right. Can we can get one? Let's put that on. All right. Now I'm ready to go back and fight the last giant, but I will do that next time. This is enough for the first one. So, have a lovely day, everyone. See you next time.